Home is where the heart is. Brother Nahas, the Prime Minister, is talking bolder dash, complete and total nonsense. May I continue? The office of the President, in terms of the Constitution, was established in Chapter 5, Article 27. The functions, powers, and duties of the President are outlined in Article 32. In the earlier, the President has the powers to appoint the following persons the Prime Ministers, Ministers and Deputy Ministers, the Attorney General, the Director General of the National Planning Commission, or the Planning Commission for that matter, or any other person or persons as required by this Constitution or any other law. That is to say, there is nowhere in the Constitution as it stands now no requirement and or existing law that imposes a right and an obligation on the president to appoint governors. It does not exist constitutionally. So that is to create or to bulldoze through a law via voting cattle in Parliament is to make the Namibian Constitution an elastic paper tacker. Amendments should be produced or be a product of necessity and not a baby of a political desire, convenience, or outright political opportunism. Regional councils and their governors are a constitutional stipulation and requirement. Read, for example, Principle 8 of the 1982 Constitutional Principles the so-called plan by the Western Five, with Theo Bian Gurirap, at the beginning of the writing of the Constitution proposed to form the framework and the basis for, rough, for drafting our Constitution, reads as follows. Provision will be made for the establishment of elected councils for local and original administration. That is the constitutional requirement a governor, in these circumstances, is a product of an elected body. Base FM, your home station.